Thanksgiving is this Thursday, and people have already started traveling ahead of the holiday. Getting a start early. Iowa Disease Reporter Jasmine Payute live at Philadelphia International Airport with some trips, travel tips, I should say, from the TSA. Jasmine, good afternoon. People heading out on those flights. Hi, Ross Janelle. The biggest tip we can give you is to leave early. It's Monday, still a few days away from Thanksgiving, and you can see this TSA line has grown, especially since this morning. TSA officials are asking people to be patient because this will only get worse as we get closer to Thanksgiving. It's officially Thanksgiving week. I'm pumped. I'm pumped. I love seeing my daughter, seeing home. It's been a while since I've been back home for Thanksgiving. And while family and food is on top of people's minds, jam-packed airports, maxed out parking lots, and pricey tickets are just some of what travelers will have to face on their way to the dinner table. Nearly 55 million people are expected to be on the move with the holiday rush already on. Traveling here from Orlando, the airport was crazy. People were about to fight and everything. In there. Really? Um, they were trying to butt in line and... It's wild out here. The lines at Philadelphia International Airport Monday moved rather smoothly with an estimated wait time of about 10 to 15 minutes to get through security. TSA officials say don't expect this to be the case all week. We are anticipating uh, 2019 pre pandemic volumes. Our projections for the Sunday following Thanksgiving show around 40,000 passengers originating out of Philadelphia Airport, which would be uh, on the high side. Airlines, on the other hand, are trying to prevent the cancellation chaos of last Thanksgiving by adding more pilots and adjusting schedules. For some flyers, their frustration comes from the price tag. Yesterday was double the price, and today, it's, you know, when I bought it, it was half the price. <laughs> Despite higher airfares, demand remains strong, with air travel up almost 10 percent from 2021. And while majority of Americans will opt for skipping the skies, airport aficionados say their biggest advice is to keep it simple. Especially with if you're carrying bags and stuff like that, there's a huge line downstairs for that, so that's why I travel light always my backpack, because I know I'm going to be boom, boom, in and out. So if you're driving, AAA says the busiest time to be on the roads will be Wednesday. If you're flying, like here at Philadelphia International Airport, they say the busiest time to be here will be on Sunday. We're live at the airport. Jasmine Payne, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Boom, boom, in and out. That's the goal. All right, Jasmine, thanks so much.